Before we start our video on the Klein uh, 1501 ratcheting screwdriver, I'm going to answer a question in one of my posts on the, the Crafton versus stack drawers. Somebody asked, how do you remove the drawers completely on the versus stack? So on the side here, we're going to flip it over on the side here. And I'm going to pull the drawer out. Bottom drawer. There's nothing in the bottom drawer here. Now you see this little lever here? And you push that down, and this will slide back. Push that lever down, slides back. That's released. Now we flip it back over on the other side. There's stuff in the other drawers, not the bottom one. And this one you have to push up to release. The drawer is now released. Let's pull it completely out. So now your channel's got to slide into your slider here and just start it there and go to the other side. Same with the other side, flip it over here and just line up the channel on the side here. It goes on the inside. You slide it in now, it's in, drawers in. So same thing when you're putting the back in. So you pull this up, this releases here. Same thing you're putting it back in and you're sliding it back in. This automatically slides in. So there, I answered my question one of the posts. Thank you for the post. We'll start our review on the Klein 15 ratcheting screwdriver. One of my screwdriver videos, uh, Dave mentioned to me, did you ever try the uh, the Klein 15 and one ratcheting screwdriver? Model number 32305. And they said, no, I haven't tried that yet. And he said that uh, the handle is much bigger for a bigger hand. And uh, he said he bought more than one. So we're going to take a look at this today. The Klein 1501 ratcheting screwdriver. So it says, try me here. There's just a ratcheting mechanism here. So what do you get with it? You get uh, Phillips 0123. You get a slot of 3 16th and a quarter inch. Robertson 1 and 2. You get a Torx T10, T15, T20, T25. And you get these uh, odd ones here, these uh, combination. And I didn't know what it was, and it's for these. It's got a slotted kind of a Robertson. So it'll fit these electrical ones. I'm excited about that. Uh, do a lot of electrical work, so that's going to come in handy. And you get the quarter inch shank, is just you take this off, that's your quarter inch shank inside the screwdriver itself. So it has a forward, fixed, and reverse ratcheting. So it's three positions on this, and the middle one, when you click, it'll act like a normal screwdriver, so it won't be ratcheting. The bits are stored in the handle. And check the back of it. So it's a spin cap on the end, so that it spins in your palm of your hand. The cushion grip handle looks like a nice handle, and uh, it is made in Taiwan. So let's open it up to see what's inside here. I don't have my Pistons Pro Utility Knife. This is, uh, blades are very dull on this utility knife. Just barely got the package open there. Pretty big handle, like that's a comfortable handle. So compared to the Mega Pro and the Roll Gear, it's a pretty big handle. Let's check it out. Put off Amazon for about twenty-seven dollars Canadian, and it's about I would say eight and a half inches long with the bit inside about nine and a quarter. So it's got three positions here. You can see, just barely see the mechanism here. So this is forward ratcheting. And it has nice ratcheting. And then you turn it. It's a little stiff. It's right in the middle. And it's like a regular screwdriver. Not ratcheting. And then turn it again. Then you've got reverse ratcheting. So three positions, two ratcheting, and one fixed. 
on the handle itself it's got the warning symbols here and it's got the model number 32305 shows a picture of where the handle is the cap and it's got client tools written on here i like the tapered shaft on it 15 and one ratchet So if you've got seven double-sided bits and one quarter-inch shank, which is the end of the screwdriver here. So if you've got Phillips 0, 1, 2, 3, you've got a slotted 3 sixteenths a quarter-inch, and you've got the Robertson 1 and 2, you've got the T10, the T15, the T20, the T25, and the combination 1 and 2. Now, here's the storage part of it. In the handle here, let's put them all back in. The clips that hold the bits in the uh, handle are closer to the main body of the screwdriver and not centered in the screwdriver. The bits snap in easily into the clips. Only room for six double sided bits. The seventh one goes inside the Quarter inch shank. That's one thing I didn't see. It's are stored in the handle. And uh, we're looking for the C1, C2. They're all engraved here. The different bits are engraved here. Here's the C1, C2. I find that these plastic things that hold the bits are really down close to the inside of the handle here, not right in the middle. Take that. Now there's a ball bearing in this. They all have the ball bearing. They want the, the C1 here. So fit that in there. Put the Phillips back here. We'll try the C1 out. So the C1 is a combination. C1, C2 for electrical. So the combination here is like a slotted and a Robertson. This fits in here perfect here. See how that fits in there? Very nice. Do a lot of electrical work. This is the screwdriver for you. That's C1, C2. Very handy to have. All the bits have that little ball bearing. So when you put it in the shaft here, it's going to hold in there nice and tight there. first ratcheting screwdriver I owned that has a combo for the electrical, where it's slotted in a Robertson. Makes it handy for if you're doing a lot of electrical work. And uh, all kinds of screws you can use with this particular combo here, electrical-wise. So it'll fit in for your ground as well. In the ground here. And you tighten up these ones, loosen them, whatever. That's a very handy bit to have. This is a quarter inch shank to move the bolt here on the uh, flywheel of the Dickinson lawnmower. Just using the uh, fixed part of the Screwdriver here to put the screw back into the flywheel here. Thank Dave for bringing to my attention the Klein 1501 ratcheting screwdriver. Very nice screwdriver. I like the handle on it and the uh, combination of fixed or ratcheting. So this is fixed and you can ratchet it. This cap rotates, which is nice. And the, uh, I like these bits, or these C1, C2 bits. I like to have the, I guess it would be the C0 for these little screws on these electrical parts. So I really like this Klein 15-in-1 screwdriver here. So please ring that bell and be notified next time I upload a video. I'd like to thank all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. Thanks so much for subscribing to my channel. Watch this for the first time today. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video. Have a great day, people.